Actually, I've been meaning to talk to you. There definitely seems to be something between you and Daisy these days. Ooh. Did you get this from Master Island? No one has ever given me a present before. Useful things. Tools or clothes. Because I needed them, not... Just because. Master Aranus, I'll find a good place for this. I've got something to show you. Come and see. You're much prettier. Oh, you're too kind. Is it... Is it warm in here? Stop bubbling, Mary. I could never have faced the Keeper myself. I never imagined a human would help me restore Dalish history. I'm sensitive, handsome, and supportive. What else could you possibly want? Nothing. Oh, not that I'm saying that I want you. I'll just stop talking now. Oh, Hawk. Come in. I was just... Am I crazy? Yes, but in a good way. It's hard to imagine someone more lovable than you. That's so untrue. I can think of someone. I... You've been so good to me. Someday I'll make this up to you, Letheline. I suppose if I hadn't left my people, I never would have met you. If you were Dalish, my people would have a kingdom by now. Does it bother you that I'm human? No, I'm not saying I'd change you for... I'm making things worse, aren't I? I just... I'm one of the Elven. I'm supposed to preserve who we are, and if I... There are reasons that it's bad to... Is it warm in here? The Keeper, my whole clan, will object if we... I'll apologize to them later. I'll even pretend to be sorry. Meryl. It's all right. now we might have to try that a few more times to really get the meaning I love you I probably shouldn't have said that did I I always say the stupidest things I was thinking of scandalizing the neighbors by having my Dalish lover move in what do you think here in Hightown the rich, fancy part of the city with no rats in it. And you. With an elf. Marvenon. You really are crazy, aren't you? If you're not afraid, then... Neither am I. She always seemed a little lonely. I get the feeling... The girl's messing in something big and dangerous. Look out for her, will you? Make sure she doesn't hurt herself. Oh, and if you do anything nasty to her, I'll cut off your balls. <laughs> All those people... gone forever. <laughs> Meryl. It didn't have to end like this. Maybe, maybe it's time I stop living for them. No keeper, no clan, no people. I have nobody but you. Whatever you do next, we'll do together. <laughs> yes, we will. Is this for me? It's beautiful. Betrayal sounds bad. Next time I'll go with flowers. It's not bad, exactly. 
This was made for a keeper, you see. Guarding a clan from the Dread Wolf is a keeper's place. It's a very sweet memento, thank you. Save that thought for after we win. Word of the slaughter spread quickly. The champion's name became a rallying cry, a reminder that the mighty Templars could be defied. He had defended the mages against a brutal injustice, and many lived to tell the tale. The circles rose up and set the world on fire. More Templars arrived at Kirkwall to restore order, but we were already long gone. We vanished into the hills, and circumstance eventually forced us all to leave the champion's side. Well, all of us except for Meryl. In all the time you've known me, have I ever given you the impression that I was turned off by crazy? <laughs> okay, point taken. <laughs>